what determines how big a tree is going to get? Like, if there's a lonely tree and it doesn't have other trees around it to compare itself to, does it just, like, get to a certain height? And it's like, you know what? I think this is as high as I'm supposed to be. This is this is how big I'm going to grow, and I'm just going to stop right here. Or And then, like, trees that are surrounded by other trees, like the redwood forest, do they compare themselves to other trees? And they're like, oh, I have to get really tall, too. Like, what? Is there is there a science to this? Do the tree... Because, like, trees feel, right? So, like, do they also compete with each other on height? What is... Like, what determines how big the tree's gonna get? I have heard, and I don't know if it's true or not, but I've heard with, like, weepy willows, if you cut at a certain part of its trunk that it'll stop growing and so it'll be like a short weepy willow and it's like a little weepy willow house so like okay (laughs) uh so if a tree is injured is it like okay well this this is the best i'm gonna do i'm just gonna stop growing now that's coffee she's nosy I know the tree breed. <laughs> I know that's not the right word. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> the brand of tree? Whatever the fuck you want to call it. I can't think of it right now. Just don't make fun of me. The 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 type of tree probably also determines it. But if there's like two of the same types of tree and they're growing next to each other, are they going to compete and try to keep getting taller? Or if one's by itself and there's like another one across the street, if it doesn't like know... Like, if the root system isn't, like, connecting, it doesn't know how big the other one's getting. Will one just be smaller than the other and be, like, the same age or whatever? Like, just, I don't know. Random question. If anyone knows, comment.